Hello. Um, well, today I just want to make an uh, announcement that I'll be doing uh, live streams uh, on twitch.tv slash Gundam Final. But uh, other than that, uh, right, I guess I'll have schedule. Nah, you know what? Probably not. It's probably something around like 10 or 11 something around there in the morning or uh, Eastern time. Um, I'll try to stream like one or two hours. I've actually found a way there's, there was a lot of problems and I've been testing a lot. So I, I think I found a good uh, setting, but the quality isn't the best. But today I have this Spike Brothers deck show you guys. Um, I found it online actually. At first I didn't really like the idea of um, Spike Bouncer and I opted for Middle Guard instead but then after playing a while I realized I didn't need to, to defense at all. And uh, this person was playing with eight critical triggers. And that's actually pretty nice and they had one copy of uh, Franny. Which is which works out quite a few times actually, so it's nice. Um, grade ones for Ganons, for Gyro, and for Wonder Boy. I was thinking of swapping Gyro for White Tight End, possibly. That that might be a good idea, maybe, because most of the time I don't find too good to use Gyro Stinger and White Tight could be a good placement for attacker if I'm missing any. No, most of the time I will not be because I have all great two and great trees, basically. Alright. Mm, I guess I can show you guys my own uh, Oracle Think Tank. I've built myself, which doesn't quite follow other players' decks. Um, hopefully, there you go, loaded in. So, I play three perfect guards of the draw trigger, three of the miracle kit, that's six draw triggers, basically. And then there's uh, six crit and four heal, basically. And here are the great ones. I don't play Luckbird. I don't find it useful at all because of the 13k vanguards. I need like at least a 6k booster to reach 18k for my vanguard. I chose not to use Circle Magus as small. Circle Magus, mm, I don't, I don't, I just don't like it. So I just use shooting bobbies. They're... they're nice, I guess. Petal Fairy, quite useful uh, at times, since I don't need the extra Carablas for Circle and for um, Sotor Orihime, I just decided not to play Gemini's. I can, I can see why people would play Blackbird and... Um, Circle and Soto Rihime, they're mostly like cycle cards, so you can draw through your deck to get more cards faster, basically. But I did really like that Lovebird has the low power, this card has uh, the restriction where you have to ride it on Great One. So if I don't ride it, it's basically a useless card, you know? And this has much more uses with CEO Amaterasu. And now, hmm. so I play four Promised Daughter, four Mei Mei, and four uh, Omyoji. I actually never saw this card at all when it was first put in or released. Um, so I did not realize it was at all. I was playing with Toms. 
So yeah. And here's my great tree. Four tree one. I do like more prop imperial though, so maybe I should cut one of my bobbies for a extra imperial. What I don't like is victorious. Um riding victorious is horrible, so I don't want to do that, so I just play one copy. It's just a winning condition that if I get it, well, I got it. If I don't, well, don't. So that's fine, in my opinion. Um, I saw some people playing with Balsas uh, Tort. Hope that's the pronunciation. And she's she's she was pretty good, but it it could be quite difficult at times. So uh, I'll I'll use Miyoji instead. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Omoji is pretty nice. It lets you put cards at the bottom and then draw it from the bottom. Which is pretty cool. So that that's basically my decks. The two decks that I've actually played. Uh, do I have? Nah. The other was default and uh, basically two default decks that came with the Karpa area. This was the other deck that I was testing out. I was testing out Luckbird, Circle, Magus. So I just decided to use Gemini, and then I had the same trigger lineup, basically. And then I had um, Sotor Yime, basically. It's it's a cycle deck. Uh, yeah, same great trees. So, I I don't know. It's up to preference, honestly, I think. But that that's all. Thank you very much for watching this, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and just a small reminder that I should be streaming right at this moment, so you can visit the website. Uh, I should put it at the description, so if you have some time, please uh, do come join me, I guess. Thank you very much.